Welcome to So Like a Pro Time. I'm Teresa Sigmund, and you are in the right place to learn to choose, alter, and make gorgeous dance sport, country, and skate dresses like this. Now, today has been a really fun day for me because I actually had three So Like a Pro members here in the Phoenix metro area in Arizona, and we all got together and we have been filming for hours. I have had so much fun working with my members. We did leotard fittings to film from the membership site, took a bunch of pictures, and discussed some of the dresses made by Tammy, which is a dress, one of, one of the dresses I'm wearing right now. Tammy is um, a really experienced seamstress, as you can tell. I will talk as I rotate here. She joined So Like a Pro in 2016 when I first made it open for enrollment, and she has what she brought six or eight dresses with her today this has so many really great details on i wanted to share this with you first of all these flowers are fabulous they are fabric she made all of the fabrics curled the edges with a little rolled edge hem they're hand stitched rhinestone they're absolutely adorable and it is a great way to add accents to any type of dance or skate dress doesn't matter what style the really fun thing about this also is that if you get tired of having a particular color you can take them all off and put on a different color so let's say you have a dress and you can't sell it but yet you want to feel like you have a new dress take off all the aqua flowers and maybe add different color flowers or just clusters of rhinestones and completely change the look of it and then you feel like you have a great new dress. Speaking of great, fringe is so fun. <laughs> now the fabulous thing about fringe is that it's pretty economical, it's very lightweight, it's safe to use for both dance and skate and it really creates a whole lot of movement. So even if I don't move much, it still just keeps going everywhere. It does kind of tickle. <laughs> if you have bare legs, it likes to tickle a little bit. So if you are highly ticklish, you might not want to use fringe. Right before we filmed this, um, because it's like 12% humidity here in Arizona, it's crazy dry. So all the fringe was sticking out horizontally. So just before we filmed, I took a dryer sheet and just brushed all the fringe down to get the static out. If you have static guard or any kind of anti-static spray, you are welcome to use that. It is perfectly safe to use on fringe. As a general rule of thumb, I highly recommend putting some type of anti-static on it because fringe does get really staticky when it's dry. I'm gonna suck it in now and rotate <laughs> so that you can see this is really, this has great lines on it. I am not tall, but yet because of the openings that create really nice dramatic lines, the wide open back, because it goes from wide to narrow is very slimming and we'll keep going here the strong angle of the skirt is really fabulous and again adds a lot of in my case much needed height should i want to wear this on the floor which i will not <laughs> this is just one of several really fabulous dresses that Tammy made. The other two dresses in the background she also made, and that is it. They are for sale. So if you are interested in buying this dress or any of the other ones, or maybe even have Tammy um, make a custom dress for you, just send me an email. And if you have enjoyed today's video, please go to sewlikeapro.com, leave me your name and email address. I'll make sure you get the newsletters and tell you when the sewing school is open for enrollment. And please share this video with all of your dancing, skating, sewing friends. Don't shimmy alone. <laughs> share the video. I'm such a goofball. And tell me, leave a comment. Tell me what's your favorite part of this dress. And if you were to join the sewing school like Tammy did, what would you want to learn? What, what kind of dance or skate dress would you want to make? And what's the one thing that you would really like to accomplish out of the school? So that is it. I will talk to you again another time. Thanks so much for tuning in.